In June 1962, a United States Court of Appeals ordered the University of Mississippi to admit James Meredith. It would take numerous attempts that year before the 29-year-old Air Force veteran and Mississippi native would become the first black student at Ole Miss. Mississippi Governor Ross Barnett, a segregationist, personally blocked Meredith's first two attempts to enroll. Mississippi's Lieutenant Governor stopped his third attempt. Meredith's fourth attempt sparked violent riots, which left two people dead and several injured. On October 1st, 1962, federal marshals sent by President John F. Kennedy successfully escorted Meredith to enroll. They also accompanied him to classes. While Meredith gained entrance into the school, he didn't gain acceptance. Students were told it was their constitutional right to refuse to socialize or fraternize with an undesirable student. Meredith would endure ongoing isolation, harassment, and violence. Even his family was targeted. A bullet fired into his home nearly injured his teenaged sister. Despite the hostility, Meredith remained steadfast and on August 18, 1963, became the first black to graduate from the University of Mississippi, earning a degree in political science. <laughs>